His batting has been described as stroke play that comes straight from the coaching manual. While Stian van Sel has certainly proven at domestic level that he has the talent, it's been his ability to work hard and be patient that's also helped him reap the rewards. I knew I was always competing with Callis and Smith because that's my way I, where I bat and with Amla. So uh, um, I just looked at myself and just to, to, to keep scoring runs. Um, when, when, like Graham or Callis retire, then just to be the next one in line. And uh, luckily, luckily it worked for me. Van Sel boasts a solid batting average of almost 45 in first class cricket. And just in terms of your preparation, I know you'll be going to conditions that are quite different from what you are used to. Mentally, what's going through your mind at the moment? I mean, you are at the Nets. What are you working on specifically? Yeah, at the moment, um, it's uh, early days. It's actually, I've, I've played cricket like two months ago, so I'm just focusing on just doing the basics as normal. Um, but like I say, are we, uh, the, the week and a half up in Pretoria, the wicket we played on was quite slow. Um, I think it's similar to, to the Sri Lankan conditions. I've been there as well two times, um, so kind of used to it, and I'll definitely use the five days before, before the test um, just to, to prep um, accordingly and then uh, take from there. The test series against Sri Lanka will be a huge learning curve for Proteus rookie Stian van Sel, but the left-handed stroke player is willing to bide his time if he's not immediately picked in the starting 11 for the upcoming two-match test series. Ronald Masinda, Cape Town. You deserve to know more. ENCA.com.